partners are all different. They all have different needs. They all have different wants. They serve a varying community, but overarching, we take a look at those uh, companies or organizations that are doing something good in the community. We want to be a part of that. We don't look at community partnerships as just throwing money at something, but we look at how we can partner and be a community steward. We recognize that community partners have different needs. and A lot of the, the partners that we work with have certain times of the year where they need to staff up. Uh, there are other times too when an organization may need more visibility in the community and we help by putting them on our social media, interacting with them and their members as well as ours. And so we take our time to sit down with them and see how Evergreen can help them facilitate their needs. We really want to be a catalyst to introduce one of our community partners to another and be that go-between that can really help each community partner be successful. So I'm the director of partnerships for the Maine Mariners hockey team. Uh, this is our inaugural season. We're part of the East Coast Hockey League and we're affiliated with the New York Rangers of the National Hockey League. We had the Portland Pirates here in the past which were an AHL team. So I think maybe some people were kind of skeptical of who we were. A lot of people didn't know about the East Coast Hockey League but having partnerships like Evergreen Credit Union gives us that credibility. You know if you go into their branches you'll see videos um, of what they show on the video board during games, trying to promote the Mariners brand and the Mariners partnership. They're really trying to drive their employees and members to our games. I'm Anastas Fodiatis. I'm the editor and founder of Portland Food Map, which is an um, online resource uh, for the food and dining community in Portland. Portland Food Map probably reaches an audience around 40,000 people through Instagram, through Twitter, and through a website, and occasionally print. The partnership with Evergreen has enabled the rebuilding of the website. And as a result, Portland Food Map reaches not only people who know about Portland Food Map or who a friend tells about the website, but it now reaches people who just are searching for something on Google and, uh, and come across the material that they otherwise, they wouldn't have anticipated was available. They wouldn't have searched for something called Portland Food Map. The sponsorship from Evergreen Credit Union got me thinking about partnerships and, and sponsorships and how Portland Food Map gets work done in a different way. Partnering with Evergreen enabled a project to happen that had me tapping into other resources and got me thinking about the potential for other sponsorships and how that could enable future growth in furthering the mission of Portland Food Bank. Most recently, the Portland Museum of Art um, went through a huge reinstallation of its collection through Your Museum Reimagined. And the point of that was to really make sure that we were being as accessible as we possibly could through our collections, our exhibitions, our programs, and through the way that we presented art. And through that, now what we're seeing is we brought together about 160,000 visitors that year when we reopened the museum, and we've been able to sustain that level of audience this year. Evergreen Credit Union sponsorship supports Free Fridays. That enables multitudes of people to come in through the museum for free. And this is an opportunity for our community to come together. Community partnerships are critical to the health of our institution. My name is Jamie Parker and uh, I've been with Portland Trails for almost 15 years now. We're a small nonprofit and like many nonprofits we you know we have a fairly small staff and limited resources. One of the problems that we've faced in the past is we have the 75 miles of trails and only two year-round trail staff and so working with Evergreen we we're able to grow our stewardship program. Reach out to the community, identify folks that were using the trails on a regular basis. Evergreen provided funding for us to buy some tools, complete a training with several different groups of stewards. Portland Trails would not exist without our community and business partnerships. It's an essential part of us being able to get the work done. I think the great thing about business partnership is that's what it is. It's a partnership and that's what we want to build here. We want people to be here long term, not one year, two years. We want to build 5, 10, 15, 20 year relationships. We've had some of the same sponsors for 25 years. So our goal is long term relationships. What can we do that makes it best for you, not just what's best for us? That's how we grow and that's how the business also become successful. So at the end of every season, we have this big marketing meeting. We come up with so many different ideas that we'd like to do. We've had some of our craziest days with some of our craziest promotions, but we can't do all those ideas unless we get the corporate partnership and backing, and Evergreen Credit Union has been great. 
We have bobbleheads that we'd like to do, which are a big investment. We have food items, we have beverage items. We took a birthday idea that we wanted sponsored, and now it's all over our Instagram, it's all over our social media. And I see Evergreen on there consistently, retweeting, liking, sharing all of our posts. So the consistency of our sponsorship with them brings back memories for fans. I think one of the important things is to have community organizations working with community organizations and keeping everything local so that the employees, the customers can see the benefit. We work with local people so our South Portland families can be touched by a South Portland organization that has South Portland customers going to it. Evergreen's partnership with uh, the South Portland Food Cover makes a tremendous impact right here in the local community. One of the great things about Evergreen Credit Union is that they lead in the South Portland area in involving themselves in community support for agencies like us. Every $25 that is given to the South Portland Food Cover helps to feed a family for almost an entire month. It makes that big of a difference. One of the things that happened just this past year was with the temporary government shutdown. We were able to, on the spot, at a moment's notice, be able to put the word out to the government employees who were affected by the shutdown to come in and to receive help from us at that point in time. Without the support of Evergreen, we just couldn't make that possible. Credit unions live and breathe by the people helping people philosophy. It embodies the work that we do each and every single day through our philanthropic initiatives. For example, Evergreen Credit Union in 2018 raised over $16,000 to our campaign for ending hunger. That's money that stays right here in Maine, right in the local community to feed people. We all should be proud of the fact that our local credit union network gives so much back to the good people of the state. It strengthens our network, but it also strengthens our relationship with our members. When our members know that we are an active participant in their local communities. Evergreen leads by example. They have tremendous community partnerships throughout the greater Portland area. They're a great example, not just for our credit union network here in Maine, but for other business organizations. They embody the spirit of collaboration. And let's face it, collaboration is what moves Maine forward, what makes our community stronger, and what provides exceptional service to our members.